Hi my friends, today we model this part. It is a very interesting part and the drawing is this one. You see there is a continuous movement of this T on the guide with dimensions 124, 122, radius 35. You can also keep in your mind these dimensions. This part is uh, number 29 from my collection of 100 mechanical parts. New empty document. Take a look of this uh, workbench and select CAD, not Bender, because we create uh, mechanical parts. New sketch this plane XZ and we draw a polyline starting from here up MMM going here once again MMM and we go somewhere here we have to make this horizontal and this vertical and we have to place these two points on the same horizontal one of them on the same horizontal with the center then we can apply symmetry of this point and this point on this axis good dimensions this is 122 radius is 35 these two are equal and this distance is 124 you have a fully constrained sketch close good now we create a new sketch based on xy plane we project this line and we draw a polyline starting from here vertical horizontal vertical horizontal vertical again and horizontal must be the last one equal uh, this line is equal with this and this two as well dimensions this is 8 this is also 8 this is 28 and the total dimension is 30 we place symmetrical 
this point and this point with this point not line you see now we have this construction fully constrained close and we apply this additive pipe we have to select edge after edge as you can see okay now we have to create this uh, feature 2256 with uh, holes of 11 diameter of 11 at a distance of 34 don't forget this radius 3 new sketch xy plane and we select a rounded rectangle placed somewhere here with dimensions 22 enter 56 enter and 3 we project this line and we apply coincident between this line and this point we also apply symmetry at this point and this point with this axis close the thickness is 17 we apply pad or extrude of 17 okay then the holes I select this new sketch circle 1 2 on the same vertical we open inside to place symmetrical this point and this point with this axis and dimensions this distance is 34 and the distance to the center is 102 divided by 2 okay hole of 11 through the part these two holes okay now we apply mirror I select both this and this the second with control and I hope they will be mirrored both here I'm not sure let's see mirror about the plane YZ and you see we don't see the holes even if the hole is here
okay now once again I select hole I apply mirror I select this plane and we have the holes there good next is this cylinder placed at a distance of 125 with a length of 40 diameter of 37 and a hole of 20. We select the XY plane to apply datum plane and to place the distance of 125. Okay, this is up from the part, yes. We select the plane, we create a new sketch, a circle with this center at 37. Close. No date on plane and extrude reverted on 40. Okay. Now the hole, we select this face, we draw a circle, no matter of the diameter and hole with the diameter of 20 and not ending but through the part okay you see the part everything is okay that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.